My name is Garth Ross, I'm from the Kennedy Center in Washington, D.C. We are here at the Great Wall of L.A. and you are watching Youth Cinemedia. Art does play a powerful role in civic life and art does give us a common ground to experience community in a totally different way. I'm here today with an incredibly inspiring group of people at an incredibly inspiring place. It's the L.A. River Channel and we're, we are here at the Great Wall of L.A. And this is a half mile of of just absolutely virtuosic art that tells the story of people over time in a particular place. I mean, makes me feel like every wall in the country should be telling a story like this. This kind of work is so important to me. One is because it's in a public space, so, you know, the intention is that this is common space, uh, that everybody can everybody can see, everybody can enjoy, it's, it's, it's something that's a community asset. So, you know, to have those messages and have those stories told in a common space is a really powerful thing. Um, the other piece is that these are stories that are not being told to this community, they're stories that are being told by this community. And a piece of art, whether it's a play or a song or a piece of visual arts, only has value in its relationship to people who are interacting with it. And to me, the Great Wall of LA has virtuosity of engagement off the chart. I mean, it's, it's all about engagement. And at the same time, it didn't leave virtuosity of technique in the dust at all because it was overseen by this mastermind of, of community art making, Judy Baca. Listen, we're not in a museum. Nobody had to pay to look at this on that block or this block or this block. I mean, the degree to which this can engage people uh, just being here on the wall is, is outrageous. But the idea of thinking back to, I guess it was 1976 to 1984, young people in this place, you know, year after year, working on telling the story uh, is incredible to me. The extent to which it's been able to stand the test of time is also outrageous. I mean, the reason that we're down here today is because there's a massive uh, restoration project going on. So even just that notion of commitment by a community over time, um, I mean, it's one thing for, um, you know, the National Gallery of Art to do restoration on a Van Gogh in a back room. That's very important. But this is people, there are people I met today who worked on the crew in the 70s and now they're back, you know, many, many years later, working on this thing, remembering experiences and conversations they had when their hand was touching that wall, you know, 30 years ago. I can't even, I just can't even imagine it. <laughs>